Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. What we have here, this follows what we have a raised to power n minus n, which is the same thing as a raised to power n over a raised to power n. This here, we have 4 raised to power x over 4 squared equals to 40 on this side. Then this same thing as 4 raised to power x over 4 square plus 16 equals to here we can write this as 40 over 1. The next step here we cross multiply 4 raised to power x times 1 we have 4 raised to power x equals to here 40 times 16 on this side. Then next step here we take the log on both sides as this here we have log 4 raised to power x equals to log 40 times 16 here. The next step here, apply the power of log n. Well, we have log n raised to power p, the same thing as p log n. This here we have x log 4 equals to log 40 times 16 here. Then from here we divide both sides by log 4. I just divide this side by log 4. Also divide this side by log 4. As this here log 4 cancelled each other here. We have x now equals to log 40 times 16 over log 4. Then this here follows on the law of logarithm. What we have log a times b. This same thing as log a plus log b. That this, yeah, this becomes x equals to log 40 plus log 16 over log 4. That this, yeah, we separate this into two fractions and we have x equals to log 40 over log 4. Plus log 16 over log 4. Then, next step here, we can write 16 as 4 times 4, that's 4 square. And what we have becomes x equals to log 40 over log 4 plus log 4 squared over log 4. Then, here, we apply the power of log n. 2 comes there and we have x equals to log 40 over log 4 plus 2 log 4 over log 4. Then here we have log 4 cancelled each other here. And 2 left here we have x now equals to log 40 over log 4 plus 2 which implies also we can rewrite 40 as 4 times 10 and here what we have becomes x equals to log 4 times 10 over log 4 plus 2 that is this also follows law of logarithm and we have x equals to log 4 plus log 10 over log 4 plus 2. Then we separate this into two fractions. We have x now equals to log 4 over log 4 plus log 10 over log 4 plus 2. Here also we have log 4 cancelled each other here, one left here, which implies x equals to 1 plus 2, that's 3, and plus log 10 over log 4. Then from here, also 10 can be written as 2 times 5. Then what we have becomes x equals to 3 plus log 2 times 5 
over log 4. Then, this also follows the law of logarithm, and we have x equals to 3 plus log 2 plus log 5 over log 4. But this here, we just separate this into two fractions, and we have x equals to 3 plus log 2 over log 4 plus log 5 over log 4. Then also here, 4 can be expressed as 2 times 2, that's 2 square. Then what we have here becomes x equals to 3 plus log 2 over log 2 squared plus log 5 over log 2 squared. Then, we apply the power of log room again, 2 comes here and also here, we have x equals to 3 plus log 2 over 2 log 2 plus log 5 over 2 log 2. And here we have log 2 cancel each other. This becomes x equals to 3 plus 1 over 2 here yeah? plus also arises as 1 over 2 times log 5 over log 2. Then next step here yeah, this becomes x equals to 3 plus 1 over 2 same thing as 3 number 1 over 2 which can be written as 7 over 2. Then plus here yeah, we have 1 over 2 log 5 over log 2. And here when we apply change of base, when we have log a over log b, this is the same thing as log a to base b. And this here we have x equals to 7 over 2 plus 1 over 2 log 5 base 2. Now, when we bring this together as one fraction, we have x equals to the SCM here that's 2. And this c becomes 7 plus log 5 base 2. And this is the value of x here we have. x equals to 7 plus log 5 is 2 all over 2. Then let's check here if this satisfies this given problem. And this will substitute the value of x here, which is. x equals to 7 plus log 5 base 2 all over 2. And this here, this becomes 4 raised to power 7 plus log 5 base 2 all over 2 minus 2. Is it equals to 40 on this side? Then we bring this power together. That's one fraction here. This is 2 over 1. We have 4 raised to power SM here. That's 2. Here we still have 7 plus log 5 plus 2. Then minus 4. This is equals to 40 on this side. Then here, stand minus 4. That's 3. We have 4 raised to power 3 plus log 5 plus 2. Left here over 2. Is it equals to 40 on this side? At this here, we express 4 as 2 square, which is raised to power 3 plus log 5 is 2 all over 2. Is it equals to 40 on this side? And this power multiplies 2 here cancel each other. We have 2 raised to power 3 plus log 5 is 2. Is it equals to 40 on this side? Then we apply the power law of log in here. Log in this is, and we can write it as 2 raised to the power 3 times 2 raised to the power log 5 raised to 2. Is it equals to 40 on this side? Then here, 2 raised to the power 3, we have 8, and times a follows when we have a raised to the power log b to this a, which is the same thing as b. As this a, we have 5. Is it equals to 40 from here? Then a stands y. Give us 40, which is equals to 40 on this side. Left hand side equals to 
right hand side and therefore we conclude that x equals to 7 plus log 5 is 2 all over 2 satisfy this given problem and thank you for watching don't forget this step subscribe for more videos turn the notification bell on share this video give it a thumbs up put your comments and join our membership package see you next class and bye for now